In today's video, we are gonna talk about Lake Toba, striking an impressive lake located at the north side of Sumatra Island in North Sumatra, Indonesia. At first sight, you would maybe say, what a beautiful big lake, however the truth is much scarier. Underneath of this lake is supervolcano covering the whole area. In fact, the whole area is top of a huge volcanic caldera. A strength hidden underneath of Toba is unimaginable. Nevertheless, humankind witnessed this event. But before we go on, if you are new here, don't forget to subscribe to this channel so you don't miss any of our educational content. Okay, let's go guys, here's the new Top Topics video. Approximately 74,000 years ago, the supervolcano Toba exploded. The gigantic eruption has become one of the most destructive natural disasters ever documented. After a huge explosion, which wiped out every living soul in an area of 200 square kilometers, followed a deadly volcanic ash falling on the ground alongside of northwest borders of India. Back then, the whole South Asia was covered in 15 cm high layer of volcanic ash. The total extent of the fallout reached about 800 cubic kilometers, which is 40 times more than the famous eruption of Tambora volcano on the Indonesian island named Sumbawa in 1815. The total amount of ejected material was about 2.8 thousand cubic kilometers, from which about 2 thousand cubic kilometers flowed on the surface in the form of lava. The pyroclastic currents from the eruption reached a distance of up to 200 kilometers far from the volcano and completely destroyed an area of 20,000 square kilometers, which corresponds to the size of the territory of Netherlands. Scientists believe that the result of this ecological catastrophe, which included a significant disruption of a photosynthesis and food chains, has led to almost complete deforestation in Southeast Asia. The surface temperature of the seas has probably also dropped by about 3, 3.5 degrees Celsius for many years. In 19th century, Tambora caused a year with no summer for the whole Northern Hemisphere. Toba brought to the world a volcanic winter for six years and the beginning of Ice Age. This has led to extinction of large ecosystems, a lack of food for all animals and almost the extinction of prehistoric human population. We don't exactly know how many people survived these hard times, 
but the most mentioned number is 10,000. Although it is possible that only thousands of them were fertile couples, in fact all species of large mammals are showing genetic regeneration after a significant reduction of populations somewhere between 70 and 55,000 years ago. Humankind was really lucky back then, but will it happen again? In the next video, we're gonna take a closer look at what would have happened if Toba exploded in modern age. Okay, that's it. Thank you very much for watching. I will see you at another one. Stay tuned.